and welcome back. This is Baller Scooper with an episode of Let's Play Xeno Gears. I am joined, as always, by Fei Fong Wong and Ellie Elaim Van Houten. We are still in Solaris. It is time for us to head to the Emperor's speech. We need to see what the hell he needs to speechify about. Uh, this this music still bothers me. These are the evil people. They are not allowed to have fun ever. Can I? What the hell? Seriously? The rotating door got me. Apparently I do not understand rotating doors. You have a ticket. Alright, go on through. Better hurry or you won't make it in time. I will always make it in time. This is an RPG. The whole game waits for me. What? You guys aren't organized, like, at all. If the if the emperor is going to be given a speech here, you need to be seated in an arena of some sort. Instead, you're gonna like staying around like it's all going to be on TV. Oh, what the hell is that? There's so many salamanders. They're not in their salamander form right now. They're more like they're in their sperm form. To be honest with you, what do you want me to say? Finally, locked into place. Now we can continue on with the story. What? Holy crap! My beloved children, you can be at ease. The Gazelle Ministry and I planned the destruction of the gates long ago. The people chosen by God, we, the Gazelle, will return to God's paradise, to the sleeping Mother God. The time for our immortality has come. We have opened the, the door to Mahanon, the place where God rests. The source of wisdom and power, the surface dwellers will no doubt use this opportunity to seize its power. However, there is no need to be concerned. As long as Solaris has this power... What? As long as Solaris has this power, like, we don't need to be concerned? Oh. Let's show stupid beasts the lambs are real power! Oh my god, they have fireworks! I'm so scared, you guys! Ellie. Hey, Ellie! S sorry, did you say something? Like, do they really look up to that old, like, skeleton looking guy? You zonin! Awesome! Your mind's not here! I was just thinking, and this crowd's noisy. What? I mean, yeah, he looks like Skeletor. Right there. You know, just with, like, a little bit of flesh over, over the bones. What's up, Krillian? How you doing? You're in charge here, too? Children of the Emperor, please open your hearts! Krellian! That's what I said. What? That's Krellian! He's the real leader of Solaris! Wait, what? He doesn't appear in public very often, that's all I know. He's more powerful than the Emperor? Why, why do I feel... something seems familiar? Flashback! What do we got? Oh, the music's gone. Oh, we have the emotional music. Oh, we're back in Nissan. I remember the, the, the one-winged angels from uh, Crisis Core. I mean, Nissan. Faye's there. We're in the same outfit. Faye never changes. He's like war. And Krillian has blue hair. Lakan. What? Krillian, you're back? I just got back last night. Who the hell is Lakan? You came back home to get paints, right? Sophia told me. Allow me to accompany you. Is that okay? Yeah. I'll leave someone else in command of my unit. Because of Solaris, things are a lot more dangerous these days. Anyway, 
Don't you feel more secure if you're with me? Thanks. Who the hell is I can? I don't even know if I'm saying his name right. I don't know if he's supposed to be some character from some time in history, but we're going with Blaycan. Because that's what his name looks like to me. Or I mean, there's so many ways to pronounce that. I might change it next time I, I start up a new session, though. No, I'm not even going to lie. What did you say? What's the name of the teacher you're studying under? Melchior. Huh. But still, why are you studying? Sophia told me the best way to calm the heart is to read a book. It's a good opportunity, and has sparked my interest in studying. Now, I'm reading three books a day. Three books a day? Krillian is a big fan of picture books, apparently. I'm sorry, there's no way you can, like, read three books a day if they're a decent length. If it can change, it will. The Art of War. That's all you think about. See, like, The Art of War. That's too thick. That's too thick for you to read three of those a day. Hey, that's mean. You know, I'm the best of all his students. He said so right to my face when nobody else was around. I see. That's great. Sounds like you found something to put your heart into. What do you mean? You have something. Your pictures are splendid. You should be thankful. Alright. Of course, they're probably better if they were on a PS2. But this is just the PS1, so they're alright. Oh, snap. Look at this. I finally completed it. This will save people's lives. Isn't that right, Melchior? With this, even Sophia will. Have we ever met up, Melchior? Who's that? Like, tent down at the bottom, apparently. What's wrong with you, Faye? I was having a flashback of somebody else's life. That guy, Krillian, I feel like I've met him before. Do you understand? Shall I translate? Wait, what? Translate? Yeah, please. I, I, it appears to me in perfect English. Whatever. The gate we control was removed by will of the Emperor. Bullshit. However, there are foolish beasts here defiling our holy land with their feet upside down. These beasts destroyed the gate and want to remove the Emperor from the throne in the confusion. So, the Emperor planned the gates to fall, but these beasts destroyed the gates and therefore we must get them. Whatever. This is a grave matter. The Emperor's throne has been polluted. We cannot rest yet. It looks like it got polluted a long time ago. Have you seen the Emperor? The, those imbeciles have been caught and shackled like the dogs that... Wait, what? Who'd you guys catch? All five of them? Ah, crap. I blame Choo Choo. Choo Choo got you all caught. I know it. Bart! Shut up, Faye. Don't yell. Or they found out you're a land dweller. Sorry, couldn't help it. They've been caught. Damn. Let's go. We gotta help them. Wait. He's still talking. To revive our progenitors. The gazelle of old. The day after tomorrow. These land dwellers will be disposed of. In the Soylent system? No, but Soylent Green is people! It's people! What's that? It's where we feed the dead people to the new people. Kazel are pure breed Solaris people, the word means first class citizens. But in this case, it probably means the Gazelle Ministry. Long ago, the members of the Gazelle Ministry lost their fleshy bodies in order to protect the Solaris people. I've heard the Soylent system is an important support system for Solaris, but I don't know much else. It's people! I'm telling you now, it's people. Anyway, it's probably a cover for some kind of experiment. Don't tell me what to do! I'm going! Those guys won't stop me! That's why I said wait. We don't know what's going on over there. If we just run out there brazenly, we might just fall into the same trap. 
palace is on alert, so we need to investigate. We don't even know where they are taking. Or if they were taken prisoners? Whatever. We don't know where they are! We still have two days. I'm sure there's a way to help them. We must find it! How do you know we have two whole days? What if they change their mind and then tomorrow? I mean, it is possible, isn't it? Maybe. But there's nothing we can do, right? Satan wasn't there, which means he's probably watching the broadcast somewhere right now. He's already got a plan. He's already si fixed everything. We just need to go meet him. And, and so we can go like, hey, nice job. First we must find him. He knows the layout of the central core of the city better than I do. What doesn't Satan know? Seriously. So let's not do anything careless, okay? Where is he? We need him. Didn't you... <sighs> Phagus does not listen. What do you want me to say? Don't be a snot. You haven't thought anything out at all. I have thought even further less, so we need to do what I say. I'm just saying, we have to be careful. But, what? Hey, what's going on? Look, we've been discovered. <laughs> and whose fault is that? Seriously. This way. City alert. Two suspects located. Send the security cubes me. Uh, couldn't they have just, like, said sorry, lover's coral or something? They didn't, like, have to run or anything. You two, please stop all action. <laughs> Suspicious person sighted in Arbo Plaza investigating. Ellie, they're here. If those security cubes catch us, we're in big trouble, Faye. This way, those are not cubes. Holy crap, she jumped off the world! Stop, desist from moving! I'll have to jump! That's a hell of a jump! They escaped! Why Why do the cubes have to talk to each other like that? They don't need to look at each other, they're, they're freaking robots. Whatever. You guys don't have eyes, yet you still faced each other so you could talk to each other. This way? Suspects escaped! Emergency response! Did we go into the sewers? That's what it looks like. We did! Faye, are you alright? Yeah. It was just so sudden. We gotta get moving. Those weird robots are coming after us. What's wrong, Ellie? So this is the place. I might be able to do something. Anyway, let's try to run through here. Yeah, let's do it! Um, can I go this way? No. Ah, no, they're after me! They're gonna get me! No, don't let them do it! No, they caught up! Oh no, whatever shall I do? Yeah, every time they catch you, it's a battle. And it's against these things, so... Why not use this opportunity to show off a little bit of phase death blows? Oh, Fukai! Oh, we saw this one, didn't we? Whatever, it's still off. How much damage does that do? 379, and down it goes. Either defense up, defense down. Okay, so... We want to go for a regular attack, and I believe this is the strongest physical attack that, that Ellie has. As you can see, I mean, we're doing a ton of damage. That should be well more than enough to take it out. Down it goes. These things are easy as hell. So you could